Hi, my name is Paweł Spechalski and it will not be an exaggeration when I will tell you that currently the Matek is the most innovative flight controller manufacturer in the world. Really, honestly, they are not afraid to move forward, to propose something new, new format, new design. After all, they are the ones that introduced uh, us with the so popular right now uh, wing format slightly bigger board and the board I showed you like a few days ago which is F765 wing which is the most powerful probably right now flight controller they also are doing something smaller but before I will show you the, the, the new version let's take a look at the old version somewhere last year uh, Matek showed uh, and started selling this this is called uh, Matek F411 wing which is like truly a relatively small flight, con flight controller designed for the airplanes that has the integrated PCB is small only two UARDs uh, not very many outputs and you can put it on almost everywhere it fits almost everywhere and it works just fine if you do not really expect a lot of functionalities and a lot of outputs and the serial ports to connect your GPS uh, and uh, smart audio and LiDAR and something else and something else blah, blah 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 this is really a very decent flight controller with integrated power distribution board and reasonably rated voltage stabilizers now now they are showing this this is smaller this is this is called smaller better uh, different, newer. This is called Matek F411 Wing SE, second edition, special edition, it doesn't matter how we're gonna call it. And as you can see, it's more or less, um, I don't want to say half, but two-thirds of the size of the original F411 Wing. What's so special about this? It's it's not really special, um, because it's not the the high tech it's not it does not have plenty of outputs it does not have plenty of serial ports and uh, multi capabilities but it's really 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 very small because come on let me take it's less than three centimeters 30 millimeters on one axis uh, the height is around less than one centimeter okay the vertically installed usb port takes some space it still has a pretty decent voltage stabilizer uh, on board. I do not remember the number right, right now. Uh, and if we remove the screws connecting the bottom and the upper, ta -da -ta -da -ta -ta, ta -ta -ta, you will notice something interesting. This is a sandwich design. They wanted to make this flight controller small enough, much smaller than the original 411 wing. So there is a connector connecting upper part with the lower part. The lower part holds the voltage stabilizers and the PDB and some of the outputs, while the other one has the OSD, has the F411 and it has the gyro and extra stabilizer probably only for the electronics and it's superb it's so small that oh come on this thing definitely will find a use on my in my in my flying fleet because I'm slowly preparing to convert a second little glider into a RC airplane I will probably just use this because this is so small that it it will fit little without absolutely any problem and also i will put this one on the next generation on my of my rc airboat because the first one was not let's say not the first one the, the, this year's model was problematic i will be using this one so uh, i have no idea why the google assistant just started to say something either way something very interesting if to sum things up something very interesting if you are planning or building or have a small light rc airplane a foamy a typical foamy that's 600 millimeters 900 millimeters something really like compact and you only want to have maybe a gps and a serial receiver and osd no, nothing really fancy and you do want this to be small and light amazing 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 i'm very happy that the matek really made a small version smaller version of the wing controller because if you even try to compare this with the regular 36 by 36 flight controller we use on the drones oh come on 
well, so much smaller. Okay, it's bigger than the 20 by 20 stack, but 20 by 20 is really like too small for airplanes, at least from uh, my perspective. Um, so yeah, I'm not sure if you can buy the F411 Wing SE yet, uh, but if, yeah, this really looks very, very, very interesting. And that's all for today and until the next one. Bye.